Hey everyone, it's Grandma Scratcher here in Florida and I just wanted to tell you I got upgraded to lakefront property last night. Um, so things have been crazy here. It's why I haven't posted. Everyone's good. We're safe. We're good. We have power. Uh, clearly there was a flooding issue, uh, but just in the back acreage. We're good at the house. And I, I forgot to mention at the beginning of this video that noise you hear is my neighbor next door. Um, they are trying to remove a huge carport that he had installed a few months ago to cover all of like his four wheel toys that thing looks like a giant stepped on it and crushed it and the bad thing is his wife's new truck was under it and part of the metal framing went right through the windshield so was the windshield damage full of rain full of crap oh it's heartbreaking um but that's that's noise you hear in the background sorry about that um we had some siding come off we had all of the skirting rip off. We were outside at 11 p.m. and 2 a.m. in 60 mile an hour winds, horrid rain, putting skirting back on our house and then moving the cars so they were up against the house to keep the skirting on because if the skirting rips off, all kinds of things can happen. The winds were horrifying. I was so terrified. The wind, when it was whoom, whoom. I just, I cannot stand it. I was so scared. This is, I've been in Florida my entire life. So has my husband, so have my kids. And I'm telling you, this is the most scared I've ever been in my entire life of a storm. Um, our roof is good, our porch is good. I mean, everything's good, the cars are good. Um, and we had like a, a piece of um, wood come off of our water heater cabinet. We've got like minor stuff. Most of it we can do ourselves. I mean, we didn't even need to go to the store today to get like things to repair with. Um, we had most everything here and you guys know that since we did the house ourselves, you know, remodeled the house ourselves, we are pretty handy. Um, and of course I have people I can call in if necessary, but look at, look at my poor little banana tree up there. I don't know if it's going to make it. It's used to a tropical situation, but I think this might be a bit much for it. Um, but yeah, we're good. We're good. Um, everyone that we've been in touch with, you know, relatives and such, they're all good. We were very, very fortunate. We had power the entire time. We still have power. We are super, super fortunate. Um, all of our family is good. Friends are good. They all still have power. They're all doing well. Uh, but I'm, it was the longest night of my entire life. I'm telling you. And I've been through a lot of hurricanes in my time. I've been here my entire life for every hurricane and this hands down, even my husband, there were times when he would turn and look at me and I would just look at him and we'd be like, shit, shit. Like you could just hear every creak, every groan, every rip, every everything. There was a tree that snapped in the back acreage. We could hear that. Um, you know, you hear every single thing that happens. And luckily we were able to watch the news. Of course, now there's weather apps we could keep track of, everything going on. And um, our lake is receding. You can see here uh, how far it came up. And that's how much it's already receded. So like there is a better view. It's going away quite quickly. So the waterfront property won't be for long, but, um, but we are good. And I hope you all are too. Feel free, of course, drop stuff in the comments down below. You know, I respond to you all. Um, if anyone has helpful information, drop that down below too. If anyone's looking for information, drop that down below too. Um, because you know, long story short, the grandma scratcher community is fabulous. You all are what makes it fabulous. It's why we're almost at a hundred thousand subscribers. You guys are the best. We are hands down the nicest scratcher community out there. And I'm so proud of you all for that. And I really hope that everyone made it through safe and sound. Um, I love that you guys checked on me and I try to check in on you too, but when the wind is whipping and you're outside, you know, we had to, we had to dry clothes like four times last night because we would have to go back outside for something. Um, you know, the cats were freaking out. It was, it was a hot mess for sure, but we're here and we're good. And I'm grateful for that. We are so fortunate that things worked out the way they did for us. Um, and I love you guys and I hope everyone else is safe and, and sound too.